Hello, how are we doing? All good? All good. Jim, is there one thing that we've missed out? No. No. Uh, he's, he's, um, he's, this is his time. This is what he's worked for. James is ready. A1. It looks like you've prepared meticulously for this. What can we expect from James DeGal coming into this fight Saturday? Best performance of his career. Yeah, about that. I think it's going to be. He's got a, good, a very good opponent in Durrell. Tricky southpaw. Knows the ropes. Olympic bronze medalist. Uh, James has to perform to the best of his ability, and he will. Interesting enough, I've seen on some of the some of the posters. It doesn't say about the world title. With PBC and some of the fighters coming in at different weights, is that any concern to you in the team? This is for the IBF Super Middleweight Championship in the world. James has spent the last 20 years working towards this day. And um, some of the iodine and sterile um, factors about this, the PBC, we're not totally, you know, at one week. So this is for the IBF Super Middleweight title and James creating history will be celebrating like lunatics. How much does it mean to James to be the first Briton to win, win Olympic gold medal to then go on to win a world title? What would it mean to him? Can you put that into words? Well, from day one when he turned professional, we set out the goals, set out the dreams, and his main dream was to become, exactly what you just said, the first Olympic gold medal from our country to win a world title. So that has been a driving force in his career. It's something you've already mentioned over and over again. And now it's here, so it's his chance now to deliver, and he won't let no one down. I mean, James DeGaulle, Andre Durrell, both southpaws. What kind of fight are you expecting to see from this, from James a really, a really exciting fight. I think the two stars will gel. Um, there is a plan A, a plan B on both sides. But who is, carries the fastest guns in the West? That's the real question. And I say, undoubtedly, it's James DeGaulle. James looks in tremendous shape. We've seen over maybe the last two years the niggling injuries, the little problems all seem to be behind him now. Can you confirm that he is in 100% in ready to go for this? Yeah, I mean, people say things are cliche, but I'll deal with facts, not fiction. Everything's written down, everything's recorded from the day he turned professional to where he is today. He is officially 100% in the best condition of his career. And Darrell will find out when the first bell rings. All right, gentlemen, I know you've got work to do. I appreciate you giving us a little bit of time, and uh, we'll catch you again real soon. Appreciate it, man. Thanks a lot. Anything for you, James, you know that.